Nate, do you, Nathan, take Rachel to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish always, and to commit yourself completely to her and her alone for as long as you shall both live? I do. Rachel, do you, Rachel, take Nathan to be a, your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish always, to commit yourself completely to him and him alone for as long as you both shall live. Thank you. Um, in every single way measurable. And, uh, you know, for, forgive this a little bit because uh, it, it's hard, but the only thing that makes me feel good about him marrying Rachel is that Rachel is equally amazing. Um, I had the opportunity to spend some, some long time with Rachel, uh, you know, when she came up to Michigan where they got engaged. And my boys loved her, and they're a good judge. So I got a seven-year-old, a four-year-old, and a two-year-old, and they're amazing. And they loved her, right? So they, and they call him Uncle Nate because I'm always on the phone with him, right? So like, Dad, is that Uncle Nate? You know, and so... Rachel is just an amazing balance for him um, in a way that he's always kind of been seeking somebody to, to, to love and where she also celebrated him, right? And that's what I love about Rachel is that Rachel celebrates every minute and every day with him because I can see it on her face. It's her nonverbals, right? And you can see it if, uh, you know, I just happen to be in sales, but if, if, if you do happen to look at nonverbals, you can tell that Rachel just adores him. She hangs on his every word. She always smiles at his jokes, even when they're bad. And they are sometimes. It's okay. Mine are bad too sometimes, though. But, you know, but he deserves her and she deserves him. And it, it, it's just, it's a great partnership. I, I, I have no doubt that the love is going to continue to grow. Um, and I'm very excited to see the future of this relationship with two awesome people um, who are very passionate and, you know, but are ultimately passionate for each other because that's what matters. Life gets hard and I really know that they're going to weather the storm. So let's raise a glass to these two amazing people because we all love them.
by the powers vested in me by the laws of the state of Texas, I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. I'm proud to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Nate Arnold.